The following message is brought to you by Christian Sermons Online. Broadcasting Christ-centered messages around the world 24 hours a day. Check us out at christiansermonsonline.com. You've heard the good reports from friends and neighbors. You've seen the Spirit move over television. Now you can come and experience the difference of the Jimmy Swagger Crusade for yourself. June the 15th through the 17th, we will be in Kansas City, Kansas at the Memorial Hall Arena. In each of our recent crusades, we've seen the Holy Spirit move in a very real way, and we're expecting our Kansas City crusade to be no different. So for those of you that live in the Kansas City area, come and be with us June 15th through the 17th. Heroin addiction, cigarettes, tobacco, no matter what it is, Jesus Christ can do it all by His blood. And what He did at Calvary can take away anything that's troubling you or that you're struggling with. Just have faith, believe in Him, and He can do it all. This same merciful love was experienced by Zacchaeus the day Jesus came to his house. As we'll see later in today's program, In Crusade from Miami, Florida. So come along now to downtown Miami as our service begins. Such a long time we've been friends, mighty good friends. Such a long time we've 
Se pueden sentar y que Dios les bendiga. There is a fountain. Yes, it is. For healing the soul. And those who will plunge in that stream are made whole. Oh, the waters are troubled, and so is your soul. But the Spirit is moving Be completely made whole He knows you are broken The water 
doctors are troubled And so is your soul But the spirit is moving Be completely made I've sat by the waters of life's healing stream. There was no one to help me, no way to be free. Oh, but Jesus loved me. And he said tenderly, yes he did, I am the water, thank God, hallelujah, just come to me. He knows what I needed before I could have. He saw deep inside me Behind all my man All the waters are troubled And so was my soul But the spirit was moving, thank God, yes it was, and he made me whole. Sing it, children. He knows you are broken and long to be free. He sees all the heartache. can't see all oh, the waters are troubled and so is your soul but the spirit the eternal spirit, <laughs> the Holy Spirit, is moving. Be completely made whole. Praise the name of Jesus. Last week in part one, evangelist Jimmy Swaggart read from the book of Luke for the scriptural foundation of today's message. If you have your Bibles tonight, si tienen sus Biblias esta noche, would you turn with me please to the 19th chapter of the book of St. Luke? Abranla conmigo por favor al capítulo 19 del Evangelio de San Lucas. And while I read this, could I ask you to stand? Y mientras leemos esto, 
Pónganse de pie, por favor. This is what the Bible tells us. Esto es lo que nos dice la palabra de Dios. And Jesus entered and passed through Jericho. Habiendo entrado Jesús en Jericó, and behold, there was a man named Zacchaeus, which was the chief among the publicans, and he was rich. Y sucedió que un varón llamado Saqueo, que era jefe de los publicanos y rico, and he sought to see Jesus, who he was, and could not for the press, because he was little of stature. Procuraba ver quién era Jesús, pero no podía a causa de la multitud, pues era pequeño de estatura. And he ran before and climbed up into a sycamore tree to see him, for he was to pass that way. Y corriendo delante subió a un árbol sicómoro para verle, porque había de pasar por allí. I want to use for a subject tonight. Quiero usar como tema en esta noche. The words of Jesus Himself. Las palabras mismas de Jesucristo. And they can be the same words to you. Y pueden ser las mismas palabras para usted esta noche. For today I must abide at thy house. Porque hoy es necesario que pose yo en tu casa. I had a preacher to write me the other day that really was not of my particular belief. And he said, Brother Swaggart, I've just gotten a copy of this book called Straight Answers to Tough Questions. It's hardcover, over 300 pages, and actually it's a mini commentary that I think will be one of the most valuable tools you ever, ever had in your help in studying the Word of God. And it, it has, it's really a, a book of questions and answers. And he went on to say, this is the best thing that I've ever had that's helped me in so many, many ways. And I appreciated his letter. And I think it will help you too. I can't give you all the questions. I'll just touch on a few. How can a person know whether or not what he believes is true or biblical, biblically correct? Is it possible to prove there is a God? What is blasphemy against the Holy Spirit? Who is Satan? And then, uh, let me go on over here. Is abortion always wrong? What about in the case of an unmarried teenager? Is divorce always wrong? Are there circumstances when it is permissible? Uh, what about euthanasia? If parents have a terribly deformed, deformed baby born to them, should they let the baby expire without medical help? Or should they use every available means to keep their baby alive, even though the child will be little more than a vegetable? Is capital punishment scriptural? Are homosexuals born that way? Um, can an indiv individual believe in creationism and evolution at the same time? Do you believe that the practice of cremation is scripturally wrong? Um, <clears throat> on and on we go. Um, is it right for a preacher of the gospel to endorse certain political candidates for office? Do you think it's scripturally permissible for a Christian to participate in state lotteries? Is it wrong to offer items for sale in a church? Um, is there such a thing as soul travel? Somebody might ask, what in the world is that? Uh, is it wrong for a Christian to fight or even kill during times of war? On and on we can go. Um, what does the Bible teach concerning personal holiness and how can I grow in holiness? Is all dancing sinful? <clears throat> what about aerobic dancing? <laughs> uh, according to Deuteronomy 22.5, do you think it is proper for a lady to wear pantsuits? What do you think about mixed women? What does the Bible say about smoking? Uh, is it biblically wrong to join the Masons or other such secret orders? Is it wrong for a Christian to attend movies or watch television? Um, on and on like this, hundreds of questions that give straight Bible answers that go into some detail and I think will be of utmost blessing to you. Now you can have this, now listen carefully to me, you can have it for a gift of just $14.95 to the ministry. A gift of $14.95 to the ministry plus $2 postage, shipping, and handling. That's the USA or Canada, the same price. We'll get it right on back to you. It's over 300 pages, hardcover, straight answers to tough questions. Order this today. I believe that it will be a great blessing to you.
We believe this hardcover volume entitled Straight Answers to Tough Questions is a reference book you will turn to time after time. In it, you'll find direct, no-nonsense commentary addressing issues some would consider too hot to handle. To reserve a copy for yourself, please give us a call now and place a gift of $14.95 plus $2 postage and handling on one of your bank cards. If you prefer mailing your donation in the form of a check or money order, address it to Jimmy Swagger, Baton Rouge, Louisiana, 70821. Our Canadian office is located in Niagara Falls, Ontario, postal code L2E6V9. World Evangelism Fellowship is pleased to invite you to its 1990 National Single Adult Conference June 7th through the 9th in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. The conference is going to be great with good food and fellowship in the JSBC cafeteria, recreation at the Modern Health Facility, exciting praise and worship with the Crusade Team Band, accommodations in comfortable air-conditioned dorms, and teaching from the Word of God that is sure to meet your needs. The cost to register is only $25, so call or write today. We now return to Miami, Florida, with evangelist Jimmy Swaggart and the conclusion of today's message. Today, I must abide at thy house. The Bible said that Zacchaeus would see Jesus. La Biblia dice que Zacchaeus quería ver a Jesús. But there were so many people crowding around. Pero había tanta gente a su alrededor. Now let me say this to you. Déjeme decirles esto. There will always be hindrances. Siempre habrán dificultades. It's never easy. Nunca es fácil llegar al Señor. O sea, I want to say that again. Quiero repetir eso nuevamente. It's never easy. Nunca es fácil. I wish it were, but it isn't. Ojalá que fuera fácil, pero no lo es. Satan will fill your mind with doubts. Satanás llenará su mente con dudas. Others will ridicule with sarcasm. Otros se burlarán de usted en una forma sarcástica. Satan will try to hinder. Satanás tratará de obstaculizarte. And if you let the hindrances stop you, you'll never see Jesus. Y si tú dejas que esos obstáculos te impiden llegar a Jesús, nunca le verás. I want to get something through to you tonight. Yo quiero en esta noche proyectar una idea y que les pueda llegar. The only thing that matters is seeing Jesus. La única cosa de valor, de importancia, es ver a Jesús. The devil will try to stop you. El diablo tratará de frenarte. Your relatives will try to stop you. Tus familiares lo harán también. Demons will try to stop you. Los demonios tratarán de obstaculizarte. Even your church might try to stop you. Aún tu iglesia tratará de obstaculizarte. But don't let anything stop you. Pero no dejes que nada te detenga. Don't let anything stop you. No dejes que nada te detenga. If you want to see Jesus, you can see. Si quieres ver a Jesús, le podrás ver. Now the Bible said whenever the crowds pressed around. Pero la Biblia dice que cuando la multitud le agolpaba, he ran and he climbed up a sycamore tree. Él corrió y subió a un árbol sicómoro. Now this was the richest man in Jericho. Este era el hombre más rico de Jericó. I can't hardly see him climbing up a sycamore tree. No puedo imaginarme al rico subiendo a un árbol sicómoro. I don't know who the richest man in Miami is. Yo no sé quién será el hombre más rico en Miami. I know it's not anybody sitting on this platform. Yo sé que no es ninguno de los que están en esta plataforma. <laughs> And I know it's no one in this audience. Y yo sé que ninguno de los que están allá afuera tampoco. But it just might be watching television. Pero puede ser que me estén viendo por televisión. And you say, well, now I don't know about climbing up a tree. Usted dice, yo no sé acerca de eso, de subir a un árbol. That's humiliating, isn't it? Eso es bastante humillante, verdad? It would be humiliating for old blind Bartimaeus to climb up a tree. Sería humillante que el ciego Bartimeo subiera a un árbol sicómoro. But for the richest man in Jericho, pero para que el hombre más rico de Jericó, he's got a big mansion. Él tenía una gran mansión. Finest of chariots. Los mejores de los mejores carruajes. Servants galore. Sirvientes en su casa. No doubt that day he had on the most expensive robe that money could buy. Y no cabe duda que ese día lucía el traje más costoso. He was rich. Era rico. But he, and I lost my button on my coat. <laughs> Cayó el botón de saco. I want the news media to see it. Now look at it now. Yo see? Que la prensa vea eso.
Do you think I, you think I could get some of the news media to send in an offering to get my Well, I guess that lets me out too, huh? Supongo que eso me elimina a mí también de ser el hombre más rico aquí esta noche. He's got on a garment that would have cost several thousands of dollars in today's money. Su vestuario costaría miles de dólares en nuestros días. Because he's rich. Porque es un hombre rico. But the point I'm trying to make is this. Pero lo que quiero señalarles es lo siguiente. What does it matter what people think? ¿Qué importa lo que piense la gente? Mister, when you go to the graveyard, they're going to haul you in the same hearse as they haul the beggar. Mi amigo, cuando te lleven al cementerio, te llevarán en el mismo carruaje en que llevan al hombre más pobre. They're going to put you in the same earth. Y te van a poner en la misma fosa, en la misma tierra. Put you in the same casket. En la misma ataúd. And you're going to take the same thing with you the beggar took. Y vas a llevar lo mismo contigo que llevó el pobre. Nothing. Nada. I can, I can almost get into Zacchaeus' mind. Casi puedo yo explorar la mente de saqueo. I can almost read his mind. Casi puedo yo descifrar su mente. I can almost go back 2,000 years ago and feel his feeling. Casi puedo retroceder 2,000 años atrás y, y sentir lo que él sentía. I can see him standing there. Le puedo ver de pie allí. Jesus is about to come by. Jesucristo está por pasar. He may never have this chance again. Tal vez nunca en su vida vuelva a tener esta oportunidad. There may never be another moment like this. Nunca habrá un momento igual a ese. And in all honesty, there won't be another time like this. Y en toda sinceridad, no habrá otro momento como the este whole, esta noche. The Holy Spirit is dealing with Zacchaeus. El Espíritu Santo está tratando con Zacchaeus. And he's dealing with many of you. Y está tratando con muchos de ustedes. He's speaking to your heart. Está hablando a tu corazón. He's telling you this is it. Él te está diciendo, este es el momento. He's coming this way. Él está pasando por aquí. Don't miss him. No lo pases por alto. Don't let him get past. No se lo pierda, que no pase él. Do whatever you have to do. Haga lo que tengas que hacer. And I can feel Zacchaeus's thoughts. Y puedo sentir los pensamientos de Zacchaeus. I can read his mind. Puedo leer, descifrar su mente. He says, I don't care what they think. Él dice, no me importa lo que piense la gente. I don't care what they say about me. No importa lo que digan de mí. I've got to see him. Yo tengo que ver a Jesús. I've got to see him. Tengo que verle. And I'm so short that I can't see over people's heads. Y estoy tan seguro que no puedo verle a través de la cabeza de las demás personas. He's passing this way. Él está pasando por aquí. And I'm going to climb up in that tree. Pero como soy pequeño voy a subir al árbol. I don't care if it ruins my suit. No importa que se arruine mi traje. I don't care if I lose my button. No importa si se me rompe. El traje. I want to see Jesus. I want to see Jesus. I want to see Jesus. Quiero ver a Jesús. Let me tell you this. Déjame decirte esto. When you want to that bad, cuando tú quieres algo así de, de fuerte, you'll see. Usted lo verá. Do you hear me? Me oyeron? When you're that desperate, cuando te, estés así de desesperado, when you when you when there's something in your heart that cries out, cuando hay algo en tu corazón que gime. I had a man to tell me the other day. El otro día me dijo un hombre. It was in the San Antonio airport. En el aeropuerto de San Antonio. He came up and introduced himself. Vino y se presentó conmigo. He said, Brother Swart. I was sitting in front of that TV set. Dijo, hermano Swaggart estaba yo sentado ante el televisor. And he said I'd gone the last mile of the way. Y yo había caminado ya la última milla. He said when you gave the altar call. Cuando usted dio la invitación al altar. I got down on my knees. Yo caí postrado sobre mis rodillas. I laid my face on the floor. Y puse mi rostro sobre el piso. And I said Jesus Christ. Y dije Señor Jesús. You're my last hope. Eres mi última esperanza. Come into my life. Entra en mi vida. And he said Jim. Jimmy Swaggart. Y me dijo Jimmy Swaggart. Jesus came in. Jesucristo vino a mí. Jesus came in. Jesucristo vino. 
Let me tell you something today. Déjame decirte algo hoy. That's the reason the devil wants this television program off. Es la razón por la que Satanás quiere quitar este programa de televisión. That's the reason he's moved heaven and hell to get us off television. Por eso él ha trabajado fuertemente para quitarnos de la televisión. But we're still here. Pero todavía estamos aquí. We're still here. Todavía estamos aquí. You know why we're still here? Saben por qué estamos aquí? Because we preach Jesus. Porque predicamos a Jesús. Jesus. Jesús. He's our message. Él es nuestro mensaje. He's our sermon. Es nuestro sermón. And he's our song. Y él es nuestro canto. Glory to God. Gloria a Dios. Zacchaeus is up in this tree. Zacchaeus está arriba del árbol. The richest man in town el, up a tree. El hombre más rico en la ciudad en, arriba de un árbol. And he sees Jesus coming. Y él ve que Jesús se le aproxima. He was even greater than he had imagined. Él era más grandioso de lo que él se imaginaba. He watches him as he walks down that Jericho road. Lo contempla mientras viene caminando camino a Jericho. His disciples are around him. Sus discípulos le rodean. You could not mistake Jesus. Y usted no podía equivocar a Jesús con otra persona. You watch him as he comes. Lo mira mientras viene caminando. You see the look on his face. Y usted contempla su rostro. It's like pure heaven. Es como el cielo mismo. It's like mercy. Es como manifiesta misericordia. It's like, it's like grace. Como que hay gracia en su rostro. It is pure love. Es amor puro. For the Bible says God is love. Porque la Biblia dice Dios <laughs> es amor. Do you hear me? Me están oyendo? God is love. Dios es amor. <laughs> Do you hear me? ¿Me están oyendo? Some human beings may not understand Algunos love. Algunos seres humanos tal vez no lo entiendan. But God is love. Pero Dios es amor. He loves you. Él te ama a ti. For God so loved the world. Porque de tal manera amó Dios al mundo. That he gave his only begotten que son. Que a su hijo unigénito. That whosoever believeth in him. Para que todo aquel que en él cree. Shall not perish. No se pierda. But have everlasting life. Mas tenga la vida eterna. And Zacchaeus is hanging on to the limb. Y Zacchaeus está colgando de aquella rama. He doesn't take his eyes off Jesus. Y no quita sus ojos de Jesús. He watches him as he walks right under the tree. Mantiene su vista fija sobre él al pasar debajo del árbol. And all of a sudden, Jesus y de, stopped. Y de repente Jesucristo se detuvo. Jesus stopped. Jesucristo se detuvo. <laughs> a hungry heart will stop God. Un corazón hambriento parará a Dios. A thirsty soul will stop God. Un corazón sediento frenará a Dios. Help, glory to God. Oh, hallelujah. God, God will God. stop if you want it. Dios se detendrá si usted lo quiere. God will stop if you want it. Dios se detendrá si usted lo quiere. He may not have stopped when the new president was sworn in. Tal vez no paró cuando el presidente nuevo fue inaugurado. He may not stop when your team wins. O cuando su equipo gana, él no se detiene. But for a hungry heart, he will stop. Pero él se detiene para un alma hambrienta. For a thirsty soul, he will stop. Un alma sedienta hará Dios pararse. I'm trying to get you to understand something. Estoy tratando de que entiendan algo. I don't care whether you're rich or poor. No me importa si eres rico o pobre. You may not even know who your daddy or your mama is. Tal vez no sepas quién es tu papá o tu mamá. But if you're hungry for God, pero si tienes hambre de Dios, he will stop. Él se detendrá. He will stop. Él se detendrá. He will stop. Él se detendrá. And he looked up. Y él miró, levantó su vista. And he saw Zacchaeus. Y vio a Zacchaeo. And he spoke to him. Y le habló. He called him by name. Le llamó por su nombre. He knows your name. Él conoce tu nombre. He knows your name. Él conoce tu nombre. He knows your heart. Conoce tu corazón. And he says, Zacchaeus. Y le dijo, Zacchaeo. Make haste. Apúrate, date prisa. Come down. Desciende. For I'm going to eat chicken with you today. Que hoy voy a ir a comer pollo a tu casa. Zacchaeus. I'm going home with you, Zacchaeus. I'm going home with you, Zacchaeus. 
Zaqueo. I'm going home with you. Voy a tu casa, Zaqueo. He wants to go home with you. Él ir a tu casa. And you. Y contigo. And you. Y contigo. And you. Y contigo. And you. Y ti. And you. Y usted. And you. He wants to go home with you. Quiere ir a tu casa. Some of you say I don't have anything to offer him. Alguno me dice yo no tengo que ofrecerle. He doesn't want anything you have. Él no quiere nada de lo que tengas. He's got something to offer you. Él tiene algo para darte a ti. He's got something to give you. Él tiene algo para darte a ti. Make haste. Date prisa. Come down. Desciende. For today I must abide at thy house. Porque hoy debo posar en tu casa. For today I must abide at Porque thy house. Porque hoy debo posar en tu casa. You know I have a feeling. Saben yo siento algo. That right this moment. Que en este momento mismo. Zacchaeus is listening in. Zaqueo nos está escuchando. He's leaning over the portals of glory. Él se está uh, por los portales de gloria nos está oyendo. The Bible says we are surrounded. La Biblia dice que estamos rodeados. By so great a cloud of witnesses. De una gran multitud de testigos. And I can hear Zacchaeus now. Y puedo escuchar a Zaqueo ahora mismo. Saying, brother Swagger. Diciendo, hermano Swagger. Tell him what happened next. Dígale lo que sucedió después. Tell him what happened Cuéntale next. Cuéntale lo que sucedió después. <laughs> Tell him what happened next. Cuéntale lo que sucedió Woo! después. Aleluya. <laughs> Glory to God. Gloria a Dios. For the Bible said he came down. Porque la Biblia dice que él descendió. And he received him joyfully. Y él le recibió con gozo. He says, "Come on, Lord." Él dijo, "Ven, Señor." Come on, Lord. Ven, Señor. I want you to go to my house. Quiero que vayas a posar a mi casa. He received him joyfully. Le recibió con gozo. He never felt this before. Él nunca experimentó esto antes. All of his money had never brought this before. Todo su dinero no le pudo traer esta paz. But joy is in his heart now. Pero ahora tiene gozo en el corazón. When I was a little boy, cuando yo era un niño, I used to sing this little chorus. Yo entonaba este corito. Can you sing, Stanley? I'll try. I've got the joy, 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 joy down in my heart. Yo tengo el gozo, 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 gozo en mi corazón. Hallelujah! Well, up in my head, en mi corazón. Down in my feet, también en mis pies. I've got the joy, 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 joy all over me. Yo tengo el gozo, 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 gozo en mi corazón. And I'll be here tomorrow night. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to Dios. When you get Jesus, when you get Jesus, you get joy. Usted tendrá el gozo. I'm glad I can worship Him. Yo me alegro que le puedo adorar. I'm not ashamed of Him. No tengo vergüenza de él. I love Him. Le amo. He received Him joyfully. Él recibió con gozo. I'm not ashamed to shout about it. No me da vergüenza gritarlo. To sing about it. O cantarlo. To tell about it. Y contarlo a otros. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But I want you to listen to what happened Pero next. Pero quiero que escuchen lo que sucedió. And I'm about to close this message. Y estoy por terminar este mensaje. The Bible said this. La Biblia dice lo siguiente. The Bible said the people murmured. La Biblia dice que la multitud murmuraba. And they said, "Do you know what Jesus is going to do?" Y dijeron, "¿Sabe usted lo que Jesús va a hacer?" He's going to go to this man's house. Va a ir a la casa de este hombre. And this man is a sinner. Y este hombre es un pecador. Isn't that horrible? Qué cosa más horrible. Oh, it's terrible. Eso es algo terrible. He's a sinner. 
Este hombre es pecador. And Jesus is going to go home with him. Y Jesús va a ir a la casa de este hombre pecador. I'd rather go home with a sinner than with a Pharisee. Yo prefiero ir a la casa de un pecador que de un fariseo. Now let me let me tell you this. Déjeme decirle lo siguiente. I want to talk to you about two minutes about repentance. Quiero hablarles como dos minutos acerca del arrepentimiento. Now the Bible doesn't use the word repentance regarding Zacchaeus. La Biblia no usa la palabra arrepentimiento cuando habla de saqueo. But he did repent. Now prove it. Sabemos que él se arrepintió y se los voy a probar. He said these words. Él dijo estas palabras. Lord, I'll give half of everything I have to the poor. Señor, daré la mitad de mis bienes a los pobres. And if I have defrauded any man, I'll restore it fourfold. Y si en algo he defraudado a alguien, se lo regresaré cuadruplicado. Now that's what repentance is. Eso es lo que hace el arrepentimiento. No, God's not telling you you've got to give away all your money. No, Dios no te está diciendo que tienes que regalar todo tu dinero. If you have any money. Si tienes dinero. But he is saying this. Pero él te está diciendo lo siguiente. Repentance means you turn around. El arrepentimiento quiere decir que te das vuelta. If you've been a drunk, you quit drinking. Si eres un borracho, dejas de tomar. If you've been a drug addict, you quit taking drugs. Si eras un drogadicto, dejas de tomar drogas. If you've been stealing, you quit stealing. Si robabas, dejas de robar. If you've been cursing, you quit cursing. Si maldecías, dejas de maldecir. If you've defrauded anybody, you return it to them. Y si usted defraudaba a alguien, usted le regresa aquello que les quitó. If you're committing adultery, you quit. Si está cometiendo adulterio, dejas de hacerlo. If you're lying, you quit. Si estás mintiendo, dejas de mentir. That's what repentance is. Eso es lo que quiere decir la palabra arrepentimiento. The story of the gospel has changed lives. La historia del evangelio es vidas transformadas. I met Zacchaeus was a changed man. Saqueo fue un hombre cambiado, transformado. Do you understand what repentance is? Entienden lo que es el arrepentimiento? If you call yourself a Christian, si usted se llama cristiano, and you're the same as you were before you became a Christian, y usted es lo mismo que fue antes de ser cristiano, you're not a Christian. Usted no es cristiano. You hear me? Me oyeron? Because when you come to Christ, porque cuando vienes a Jesucristo, you turn your back on the world. Le das espalda al mundo. You look to God. Y miras a Dios. You quit the sin business. Dejas el pecado. You come out from among the world. Sales del mundo. You're separate, saith the Lord of Te hosts. Te separas del mundo. Your life changes. Tu vida cambia. Now, do you hear what I'm talking about? Oyeron lo que les estoy diciendo. That's repentance. Eso es arrepentimiento. That's more than making a decision. Eso es más que una decisión. That's more than Shaking a preacher's hand. Es más que extender la mano al predicador. That's letting the power of Christ. Eso es dejar que el poder de Cristo come within your life, penetre en su vida, and completely turn you around. Y te dé la vuelta por completo. They'll look at you on the job. Ellos te mirarán en el trabajo. And they'll say you're a changed man. Y dirán ese hombre ha cambiado. You're a changed woman. Esa mujer ha cambiado. Your husband will say my wife is changed. Tu esposo dirá mi esposa ha cambiado. The wife will say my husband is changed. La esposa dirá mi esposo ha cambiado. The parents will say my children are changed. Los padres dirán mis hijos han cambiado. The children will say my parents are changed. Los hijos dirán mis padres han cambiado. Christ will change your life. Cristo cambiará tu vida. He'll totally turn you around. Te dará una vuelta por completo. That's what repentance is. Eso es lo que es arrepentimiento. You quit doing what you were doing Usted that was wrong. Deja de hacer el mal que estabas haciendo. Do you believe that? ¿Creen eso? And you know what Jesus told him? ¿Y saben qué le dijo Jesús? He said, "This day, le dijo, este día, salvation is come to your house." Ha llegado a tu casa la salvación. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's it. Eso es. Salvation has come to your house. La salvación ha llegado a tu casa hoy. And then he closed with these words. Y concluyó con estas palabras. He said, "For the Son of Man." El dijo porque el hijo del hombre is come to seek and to save ha a y a that which is lost. Que se había He's come for you. El vino por usted. He loves you. El te ama. He's come for you. El vino por usted. To seek you a 
and when he finds you y cuando él te encuentra, to save you él quiere salvarte. and he's here tonight y él está aquí esta noche. would you bow your heads y please sus rostros, por favor. Heavenly Father I thank you so much Padre Celestial, te doy gracias. and I would ask in the holy name of Jesus y te pido en el nombre de Jesús, that thy spirit will touch this place que tu Espíritu Santo toque este lugar. every man, woman, boy and girl here cada hombre, cada mujer, cada joven, cada señorita, will sense thy presence sienta tu presencia. I'm asking that thy spirit pido que tu espíritu, as it dealt with Zacchaeus so a, long ago al igual como trató con Saqueo hace tanto tiempo, that it would deal with every man, woman, boy and girl in this building que él trate con cada persona en este edificio esta noche, with everyone that's watching by television con cada uno de los televidentes, as the Spirit of God goes out to seek mientras que el Espíritu de Dios va en busca that Jesus may save those that are lost Para que salve que están and I'll ask it in the name of Jesus y lo pido en el de Jesús. Amen and Amen, amen, y amen. your heads are bowed, your eyes are closed sus sus ojos cerrados. this very moment en este momento preciso, you're in the same place spiritually speaking that Zacchaeus was spiritualmente hablando estás en el mismo lugar que estuvo Zacchaeus I want you to hear that again, please. Eso You're in the same place that Zacchaeus was. Hablando, estás en el mismo lugar que And it makes no difference who you are. Y no importa quién eres. He'll come into your heart. Él entrará a tu corazón. And he'll change your life. Y cambiará tu vida. How many in this building? ¿Cuántos en este edificio esta noche? Brother Swagger, I'm not living right. Dirán, hermano Swagger, no vivo bien. And I want Jesus into my heart. Yo quiero que Jesucristo venga a mi corazón. Only He can take away the guilt. Solamente él puede quitar la culpabilidad. And break the bondage of darkness. Y romper las ligaduras de tinieblas. I'm not living right. No estoy viviendo bien. Would you pray for me? Orará usted por mí. How many will slip up that hand right now? Su mano ahora mismo. Pray for me. Y dicen, Swagger, ore por mí. I will not embarrass you. No haré nada para slip up your hand, Levante please. Su mano, no le pena. All over this building. En todo este edificio, su mano. Thank you so much. Gracias, gracias. You're not coming to me. No están viniendo a un hombre. You're coming to Jesus. Están viniendo a Jesucristo. I want everyone to stand, please. Quiero que todos se pongan de pie, por favor. Todos Every, de pie. Everybody stand. Todos de pie, por favor. And I'm going to ask everyone that raised your hand. Y le voy a pedir a todos los que levantaron la mano. From the very top of the bleachers. Desde arriba al fondo, allá arriba. The main floor. También aquí del piso principal. I want you to come. Quiero que todos pasen. And I want you to stand right up here. Y se paren aquí al frente, por favor. He's waiting for you. Él les está esperando. Just as he waited for Zacchaeus. Así como esperó por Saqueo. He's waiting for you. Él te espera esta noche. Come on right now. Pasen ahora mismo, por favor. Pasen. As, as they sing it. Mientras ellos cantan. There's room at the cross for you. Yes, there's room. room at the cross for you. There is still room for one. There is room at the cross. There is room for you. Sing that verse, Thomas, please. The cross upon which Jesus Sufficient for me. We're waiting for you. 
estamos esperando más de usted. God is waiting for you. Dios te está esperando. He loves you so much. Él te ama grandemente. A hungry heart will always stop him. Un corazón hambriento siempre detendrá a Dios. He's stopping for you tonight. Él se está deteniendo por usted esta noche. To change every life. Él quiere cambiar cada vida. To change every heart. Cambiar cada corazón. They're still coming. Todavía están pasando, les esperamos. Though millions have come, aunque millones han venido, there is still room for one. Todavía hay lugar para uno más. There is room at the cross for you. Hay lugar en el pie de la cruz para ti. Thomas, sing that chorus one more time. Canten ese corito una vez más. Sing it just one more time. Cántelo una sola vez más. Hurry now. Pase por favor. Come on. Venga, le esperamos. He loves you so much. Él te ama grandemente. Yes, there's room at the cross for you. Though millions have come, there's still room for one. Yes, there's room. I want you to look at Brother Swagger, please. I thank God this young man and young lady came. God loves them so much. He loves every one of you. Now I want you to listen to me for just a moment. If you really mean business, si ustedes están haciendo esto en serio, you're serious. Lo están haciendo en serio. You're totally sincere. Y lo están haciendo con total sinceridad. And you're reaching out for God. Y se están extendiendo hacia Dios. He will meet you tonight. Él se va a encontrar contigo esta noche. And that means every one of you by television. Eso significa todos los televidentes también. He promised that he would. Él promete hacerlo. He's never turned one away. El nunca ha rechazado ni a uno solo. I want you to think of that. Piensen sobre eso. He's never turned one away. Nunca ha rechazado ni a una sola persona. He's waiting for you. Él te está esperando. I want you to bow your heads. Inclinen sus rostros. You, but television as well. Televidentes, hagan lo mismo, por favor. Bow your heads, please. Inclinen sus rostros también, por favor. We're going to pray. Vamos a orar. And I want you to repeat it after me. Y quiero que usted repita después de mí. And I want you to mean it with all of your heart. Y quiero que lo digan de todo corazón. This is your moment. Este es su momento. This is your moment. Este es su momento. It's all yours. Este es su momento. Now let us pray. Oremos. Dear God in heaven. Dios que estás en los cielos. I want you to say it with Brother Black. Repítalo con el hermano Black, por favor. I come to you. Vengo a ti. Vengo a ti. In the name of Jesus. En el nombre de Jesús. En el nombre de Jesús. I'm sorry for my sins. Lamento mis pecados. Lamento mis pecados. And the way I have lived. Y la manera en que he vivido. Y la manera en que he vivido. Please forgive me. Por favor, perdóname. Cleanse me with your precious blood. Limpia me con tu sangre preciosa. From all unrighteousness. De toda injusticia. According to your holy word. De acuerdo a tu santa palabra. Romans chapter ten. Romanos capítulo diez. With my mouth. Con mi boca. I confess. Yo confieso. The Lord Jesus. Al Señor Jesús. In my heart. En mi corazón. I believe. Yo creo. That God raised Jesus from the dead. Que Dios levantó a Jesús de los muertos. And He is alive. Y que él vive. I believe that. Yo creo eso. This very moment. En este momento. I accept Jesus Christ. Yo acepto a Jesucristo. 
as my Lord and Savior. Como mi Señor y Salvador. I give my heart to Him. Entrego mi corazón a Él. I give my life to Him. Entrego mi vida a Él. I give my sins to Him. Entrego mis pecados a Él. I give my guilt to Him. Entrego mi culpa a Él. And according to His word. Y de acuerdo a su palabra. Right now. Ahora mismo. I am saved. Yo soy salvo. I am saved. Yo soy salvo. I am saved. Yo soy salvo. You but television, I want you to write me. Televidentes, quiero que me escriban. The address is on the screen. La dirección está en la pantalla. And you've seen me offer this book many me, times. Me han visto ofrecer este libro muchas veces. At least some of you have. Al, algunos de ustedes lo me han visto hacerlo. It says there's a new name written down in glory. Dice hay un nombre nuevo escrito en gloria. I've sent over three million of these out. Hemos enviado más de tres millones de estos libritos. This one is for you. Este es para usted. Congratulations. Felicitaciones. You found the answer. Encontró la respuesta. You found the Lord. Ayó al Señor. Hallelujah. To those of you who have just made Jesus the Lord of your life, congratulations. If you'll write to us and mention the offer number on your screen, we'll be more than happy to send you one of these little booklets. There's a new name written down in glory. It was prepared with you in mind to help you understand the fundamentals of the Christian faith as you begin a new life in Him. In it, you'll find sections on Bible reading, church attendance, the will of God for your life, and more. Our address is simply Jimmy Swaggart, Baton Rouge, Louisiana, 70821. As I urged you to obtain this just a few minutes ago, straight answers to tough questions, scores and scores of questions that give Bible answers to them, I would strongly once again encourage you to get this. I think it would be one of the most often used books in your study of the Bible, etc., etc. Only $14.95 plus $2 postage and handling U.S. or Canada. Why not call 504-768-7000? Put it on your credit card. Straight Answers to Tough Questions delivers what it promises. Page after page is filled with hard-hitting commentary that helps you to clearly understand the complex issues of our day. Order your copy now by calling 504-768-7000 and telling the operator you'd like offer number 670. Each is just $14.95 plus $2 to cover postage and handling. Have you been in a spiritual wasteland lately? Have you felt dry, burned out? Are you looking for the oasis where the water of life can be found? Then make plans now to join us for a time of spiritual renewal at 4th of July camp meeting. Five days filled with a life-giving word of God, exhilarating praise and revitalizing fellowship. Experience the refreshing water of the Holy Spirit at camp meeting, June 29th through July 3rd. Call or write today for more information. Due to increased enrollment, Jimmy Swaggart Bible College and Seminary is in need of additional faculty members in the areas of communications, Bible and theology, history, world evangelism, and a librarian. We're looking for spirit-led men and women with a great heart for ministry and called of God to teach. You must have a master's degree in your teaching field, and in some areas, a doctor's degree is required. So please send your letters and resumes to Dr. Robert Heath, Dean of Academic Affairs, Jimmy Swaggart Bible College and Seminary. Victory Tour 90 is just around the corner and plans should be made now for this once-in-a-lifetime event. To receive your free color brochure with all the information you'll need, write to JSM Tours, Baton Rouge, Louisiana, or call today. We hope that you've enjoyed this message. For further information and to discover other sermons, visit us at ChristianSermonsOnline.com